So guys, we decided to get out of the hotel today. So we're walking to the hotel zone. Came across this all natural restaurant and also host a hostel upstairs or in the back. They have really good options, vegetarian, vegan, etc. Next to it, we got the surfing burrito. It's open 24 seven. And yeah, they got burritos. Just a, probably a five minute walk away from the hotel. And also got an Oxo there, so you could come here and purchase your little snacks and chips and beers for the room and eggs. But that's the hotel next to Royal. And so it's not that long a walk, it's probably a five minute walk. Just can't see the world thing because it's behind that hotel there. But, oh, walk over here for a quick second. I also got a pharmacy over here. So if you guys need anything outside the hotel, it's only a five minute walk. Real quick guys, we're about an eight minute walk from the hotel to the hotel zone. No, gracias. Ahorita nada, gracias. Tres por uno. Que estuviera tan flaco el güey. Record me real quick. Another tip, don't wear any clothes that's gonna bring a lot of attention to you. Purposely, I wore a Superman shirt, Dallas Cowboys hat. I'm 6'1", 360 pounds. So, if you feel lonely and need somebody to talk to you, wear something so these people harass you. Watch. Quedo más caminando, man. Excelente, bonita camisa. Gracias. No, no, ya tenemos. No, ya casi nos vamos, man. Ok, gracias. Fat Tuesday. I've always wanted to try Fat Tuesday in Las Vegas, but I've never actually gone to it. Maybe I'll stop by here in Cancun. Uh, just to let you guys know, it's about, where we go? 8.54 in the morning. We wanted to get out here before the crowds get out here and get too crazy. This is one of the little malls that they have over here. Hard Rock. Cafe. There's Coco Bongo. Senor Frogs. Wow. Yeah, we're trying to get out here before. All the salespeople start selling us. Already got a pamphlet. So if you guys have been here before, you know how nice these people are. <laughs> You can see it's, a, it's very empty right now. Everyone's nursing their hangovers. But we were trying to get in early. La Vaquita is one of these clubs that get super crazy at night. Hopefully we venture out. And I'll be able to show y'all how crazy it gets. 
Mandala Beach. I've been there before, it's a nice little spot. They have a club, which is at night, here. But on the beach end, you can come in and reserve a, a table or some chairs and they'll charge you a certain amount of money, let's say a hundred bucks, but all that will go towards your, your food and your drink. Mm -hmm. Anything extra. Surpass that hundred dollar limit, they just charge you the difference. Apologize for the noise. Oh, Malongo, it's another club out here, slash bar and restaurant during the day. drink in there is 21 pesos food in there is 21 pesos so it's a pretty cool little spot here we got monkey business here one time they had a pretty cool uh, live rock band they played uh, rock and espanol and they also played uh, English rock so that's a nice little spot at night so as you can see that's the party area we pretty much covered that that's a little Las Vegas strip equivalent in Cancun And this end is a uh, more resorts. Casa Persa, Persian cuisine. That looks actually pretty good. Got another Oxo. These Oxos here are all around town, so pretty awesome. But there's a bunch of hotels and stuff, so. I'll come back when I have something more fun to watch. I see right there, that's where the main area is at. You see the Hooter sign? Our hotel's probably about a three minute walk that way. It's behind that big white building. So, excuse the look, sweating is hot. Let me see. It's 88 degrees, so I'm a hot mess, sweating but it'll be worth it. We'll be jumping in the pool here in a couple minutes, so we'll catch up to you on that.